Hello, and welcome back. So, when I last left you off, we were about to hop into the Twilight Forest portal. So, let's go ahead and do that. Hopefully this time, I will not drop headfirst into the Twilight Forest. Now, don't worry. There we go. Yeah. Took a moment. It just wasn't responding properly. It's very lag-inducing here in Twilight for right now. Anyway. Just give it a moment and the map will load in and then we can worry about escaping from under here. Now, uh, I know that I just realized something. We do not have a portal set. And I, for one, do not want to be stuck here in the Twilight Forest dimension. So, it's good that we now have that portal there. Uh, Let's see about breaking through this layer of dark leaves ahead, overhead. Now... Yeah, no, that's entirely unacceptable. No, we can't, uh, we can't break those. Let's see. M mush glooms. Hmm. Well, I guess they're a type of mushroom that only grows in the darkest forests of the Twilight Realm. Yes, let's, uh, let's see about removing ourselves from this area. Oh, sweet mother of God, what unholy abominations have I wandered into. Get away, phantom. Back! Ow. Damn, these are tough. They don't kill me. Damn! Okay, shit. Well. Okay, let me teleport back in there, see if I can get my stuff. Crap! Uh oh. Well. That is less than ideal. <laughs> okay, you know what? Let me let me quickly grab a set of iron armor. Um just just so I'll exist long enough to survive. <laughs> yeah. You know something about Tinker's construct that I always had a bone to pick with. Uh you never gave us any good armor. You, sure there was that Tinker's uh traveler's gear, but that, that that, that was terrible. It caused a whole bunch of conflicts. Nobody really liked it all that much. I, I myself didn't actually like it either. Yeah. Okay. Good, good. That should give us a minor delay that we could uh, survive with. Also, that reminds me, we should probably consider using our shield next time. <laughs> okay, where the hell are you? Shit! Yeah, 
Here, let's just teleport the hell out of here while we got the chance. Damn. He hits hard. Okay. Okay. You know what? Let's get everything in gear here. Where, where the hell's my shield? Okay, there's my shield. There's my flying ring. Okay, we don't need that right now. Probably be a good idea to have this, though. Okay, and this. Okay. Let's see here. Okay. Let's wait till I'm fully healed to try going back in there because those guys were tough. Whew. Oh, look, it's a little bird. Hello, little bird. Having a nice time in the twilight for... Well, okay, you're going to another dimension. Okay. Let's teleport back and see if we can kill that phantom. They, o they only leave their state of ethereal existence to attack you. There! We killed him! <gasps> oh, damn! Okay! <laughs> well, that's cool! Hey, we got a, a Phantom Knight trophy! That's nice. Yeah, these trophies are cool. Also, they let us uh, open up to new areas of uh, exploration. But I'm not quite satisfied yet here, because there is actually something I can make using all this night stuff. Ooh, what's this a spawner for? like to know. Is this a helmet crab? Oh wait, there's already one in here. Oh damn, okay. They are powerful. Actually, be kind of interested in keeping one of these around. Let me just uh, set a little waypoint here. Interesting. So they don't drop any night metal, but they do drop uh, fish, which is strange. But not impossible, I could imagine, because they are crabs. Um, the hell is this? What? The hell is. Hey, that's, that's not actually a bad amount of loot in here. Hey, there's even emeralds! Emeralds and gold. Now, I mean, I, I'm above all that, but, you know, that's... Uh, that's some pretty nice loot. wonder what's down here. Hmm. If you can't tell, I like to dungeon crawl. As a matter of fact, I would love to record a game of Skyrim, but sadly my computer is not good enough to run Skyrim, so I would have to get a capture card for my PS4, which, as any of you may know, is somewhat expensive. Hmm. Hello, bat. What are you doing down here? 
Yeah, this place is like a big labyrinth, honestly. It would be very easy to get lost down here if it weren't for the fact that I could just tunnel upwards. Oh, okay. This is, uh... This is the area where I found the spider. Well, helmet crab spawner. Which are basically spiders that pretend to be crabs. <laughs> Let's be honest. I think even the mod makers will admit that. So they make their weird spider noises. I'm guessing these are supposed to be some kind of idols. Hmm. Let me... Actually, let me just teleport to the entrance to the goblin dungeon. Because I know that they had a plinth for... Oh... I don't think this can actually be broken. Yeah. So, this is, I believe, an entry-locked area. And, and uh, let me see if I can understand this. Oh, okay, so... Oh, oh, I see, I see. So, you were supposed to have already beaten the Hydra before you fight the Phantom. Yeah. Okay, okay, that makes sense. But, of course, I came across it too early. It, oh, that is a pretty sheep. I suppose that's just poor portal placement then, to blame. So, well, we have the night head, so let's, let's head back through. And what we'll do next is we'll put away this nice gear that we found because it may be of use to me later on. Matter of fact, it may actually be useful to me now if I can melt it down. But uh, up until that time, it's just cluttering up my uh, hotbar. Yeah, we have armor shards. Something that I should probably bring is a uh, set of torches. Ooh. Nightly pick. Extra damage to armor targets and fuel efficiency. It's nice. Projectile protection. Mm -hmm. Phantom plate metal. Okay. Ooh. Okay, you know what? I'm going to replace our current axe with this. And I'm just going to use this Phantom Knight trophy in case we come across anything that could use that. Now, something we should get here are some torches. Torches, torches, torches. Do we have any torches? We have one torch. <laughs> whoop de friggin'. Okay, don't worry. You see, this is why I included the equivalent exchange bot. Okay, boom. 64. That's all the torches we need. Thank you. Okay. Let's go ahead and put that back. Okay. Oh, and, uh, this is why I left this. Because I knew we'd need it. Okay, don't worry, this is obviously just a glitch. This isn't the first time I've come back from another dimension and some of the animals are missing. Like, as you may notice, our dogs and griffins are not here either. But don't worry, it's, it's just a side effect. Um, yeah. But, so, we'll continue exploring in the next episode. So, I will see you all then. Goodbye.